So what's going on YouTube? I'm back in the house. Sorry about the little bit of delay there, you know. Just had a lot of stuff going on. Haven't been really been able to get out going. Not only that, I never got my mount put on to my new helmet as you guys can see in the last video that I got. So I just haven't been able to really without no mount be able to record anything. But I finally got it. I stopped procrastinating, got it up there going, you know. But yeah, I, it's a beautiful day out here today. It's uh, 90 some degrees and uh, enjoying this nice afternoon ride. Enjoying myself. Had a couple things on mine. Just really had to clear out. Um, you know, one main thing that has really been bugging me lately is, you know, there's a few people I know and I talk to on a daily basis or whatever, and they always hear them complaining about, you know, their job situation, their life situation, stuff they're not happy with. And I'm like, yo, just change it. If you're not happy with it, change it. As simple as facts. You know, people are like, oh, yeah, you know, just there's no way for me to change it. There's so many things going on. I need my job for this and that, you know. And <clears throat> I understand that. Trust me, I definitely do. Without no job, without the money you're making, you can't support your family in whichever way you're doing it. Um, but still, there, there's plenty of options you could do. Whether you like the options is up to you, but there's options. You know, Gary V said it best. If you don't know him, please definitely go check him out. He um, definitely very inspirational stuff he says, things he says about life and just business in general. You know, starting off, you want to find the job that is doing the least amount of work but it's paying you more you know what I mean so you want to have that job that is gonna pay you a lot of money for pretty much doing hardly anything and then also it's good when the job has benefits like my current situation you know I don't really do a lot but I get paid a lot for it and I definitely enjoy that and not only that for what I want to do in life my job in my situation helps pay for that you know, they give uh, tuition reimbursement up to like, I think it's up to $6,000 now a year and all that for your books and classes and everything. So that definitely helps out. That's like one or two classes a semester right there that is covered for. Um, so, you know, you got you got to find ways to do what's going to be best for you and how you're going to better yourself in life. I mean, I don't have all the answers, so please don't think I do, you know, uh, but just if you want to. The main thing is, though, if you want you want something different in life, you just got to go get it. You got to go get it. Don't sit back. Don't hesitate. Don't bitch and complain about it because that ain't going to fix anything. That's not. It's really not. You really got to go out there be like, all right, you know, this is. I'm tired of this situation. This is what I want to do. And the first thing you're going to have to do is just sit there and really think, what do you enjoy doing? What is something that you're passionate about? What's your hobbies? What, what do you like doing that you want to get paid for? You know, there's a lot of people out here on YouTube, for instance, get paid millions or not even probably millions, but a couple of thousands a year to make videos they love. I mean, it's what they love doing. They love making videos. They love love talking to you guys. They love being there doing that. And that's what they do. They follow their dreams, you know, and, and look at them. You know, there's people out there that like creating programs for apps or building stuff and that's what they do they're developers or they're you know out there with small businesses building you know homemade furniture and stuff like that so never think there's nothing out there that you can't do because once you start thinking something you can't do then you're not going to do it you're going to be in that mindset forever oh i can't do this i can't do that just do it that's all you got to do start with plan one find out what you're happy with find out what you enjoy doing the most once you find that boom step two now you go to trying to figure out how to engage it what, what stuff do you need to do to be able to do what you're doing you know maybe get a job where you know you're working nine to five or ten to six or twelve to six or whatever and while you're working there you could be working on your job your other job your side business the one that you really want to get going because technically you have time to do it. You get 15 minute breaks if some jobs allow it. Sometimes you get hour lunches or, you know, if you walk in a call center and you ain't doing much, in between calls you could be writing down ideas, writing stuff down there what you want to do. You know, that, that's all you gotta do. Just start working on that and execute. And once you start executing and all that and you are full engaged in it, step three would be just to leave where you're currently at and just go full-fledged. I mean, 
life is very short and you got to live it and you know some people say yeah i want to live it but i don't want to live it broke and this and that yeah but do you want to live it just working unhappy and being unhappy for the rest of your life or do you just rather take that chance take that leap of faith and do something you actually love doing and hey you never know it may be successful it may be successful you may blow up and be like man making all this money hardly working or having your own time of schedule and you enjoy it you know you take your holidays off when you want and you do everything you need to when you want so and but it may backfire it may backfire you know not everything is guaranteed on that note guys give me one second here gotta grab some cash out a few moments later all right guys up oh, i'm back there so like i said nothing in life is guaranteed you're gonna fail and it's okay to fail you must know that it's okay to fail so as long as you know it's okay to fail you know you're gonna be fine life is gonna knock in your ass once or twice in your days you know it's okay to be knocked down it's not the end of the world the best thing about your failures is what you learn from it and what you learn from it and you move from it and you pick up from it to get you to be more successful in the future to get you to be a better person to get you to be better in whatever you just failed in you know failure is good failure teaches you hey not everybody's perfect we're gonna fail you know it's okay but now you learn from your failure and you get up because those people that fail that can't get up are the ones that end up being unsuccessful because they're scared they don't want to take another jab from life they don't want to take you know another chance of failure because they're scared to be hurt or they're scared to lose their job they're scared to lose money they're scared to be homeless you, you can't be scared so just 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 think about that guys just let that sit in you know again I'm not perfect person I really recommend listening to he's got a lot of great motivational speeches Gary V follow him on YouTube he's an awesome guy and um he's got some great stuff he's really do and that's all I could do today is just give you guys if I could leave you guys with anything it's just a little words of wisdom and it's just don't be scared to succeed in life don't be scared to take that jump off the ledge and try something different it's gonna be okay all right guys well I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up please subscribe hit the little bell right here and uh you know more videos to come I got my my GoPro mounted so I'm definitely gonna be doing some more videos some more stuff and um yeah it's gonna keep coming so on this note guys you guys have a great rest of your day I'm gonna go out here and ride around a little bit more and uh you guys have a good one. On to the next one. Peace.